Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda The Oracle Seasons with me, Voltage Begammer. Today we are going to go to the woods of winter, even though they're by default summer, for whatever reason. Alright, let's see, what do we have to do here? Ah, yes, these. First things first, we're gonna make this autumn, because I, I'll forget otherwise. Once you got that, you can lift these up and go in this cave. This ever-elusive cave. Use magnet hands. Get this ring. Don't know if it's worth it or not. We'll find out later. Alright, lift, throw, jump. Go to a new area. It resets the season so you can reclimb that thing if you want to. I understand it'll appear here so long as it is uh fall. Yeah, autumn. I don't know why I left. Haha <laughs> Hey, there he is. Step one, he'll kill you. This should be a final one I need to kill. Yeah, that did it. Alright, now let's go on and teleport someone nearby that, uh, other place. There's nowhere else nearby. So back to Horon Village we go. Hopefully we've done enough that the kid will have developed. I'm gonna check on him really quick. Hey, he's in the same place. I don't think he's developed yet. Wait, I thought I told you low. Hopefully we'll remember this time. Alright, onwards we go. Man, I really wish I could use a fairy fountain. Ah well, we'll do that later. Alright, now we've got more pressing matters to add. Like going to Mr. Gold Sage. Hopefully he doesn't turn into a gold blizz robe and start teleporting around and shooting me. With boss music going on. Actually, that'd be very cool. It'd be better than what he's actually going to do. Slash. Let's see him. He's here. You have slain all four golden beasts. Sir, you are worthy of true power. Take it! You got a ring. Get it appraised later. How you use the power is up to you, but do not be tempted to abuse it. What? Okay. Creepy. Anyway, what he just gave us is the best ring in the game. Well, in my opinion. Some people may have different opinions, it's just part of an opinion. Yeah. That came out much lamer than I thought it was going to in my head. Cursed mind. I'll never trust you again! Alright, let's go over here. Yep, yep, walking. Basu Jewelers, it should be the latest ring I got, so it'll be the last one on the list. Praise. This one. This is the red ring, Swords damage times two. That is the best ring in the game in my opinion. I'll appraise the other ones, why not? Yeah. Yeah, watch the thing glitch out and all that. Yeah, that's that advanced ring I bought in the shop. I already have that sword, I already have the level three version of that sword, never gonna use it. Bomb damage up. Boomerang damage up. Yeah. If only more enemies were affected by a boomerang, that ring would allow you to effectively replace the sword with the boomerang. Uh, which one do I have? Uh, let's replace this one with the red ring. Where is it? I don't know where it is. Come on. It can't be that far away. Here we go, red ring. Yeah. Now, even normal enemies will die in a single hit. Yeah, I need to find more pieces of heart. Well, not really, I mean... Huh, well, what can I fill out the rest of this episode with? 
I want to end on a normal note so I can start the next episode up with passwords. Oh, I know, I can show the top of the tree. Yeah, I'll do that. Alright, let's see here. This tree's a little bit different than the other one. In this one, you got your normal fairy thing. Deep water. I don't know why there's deep water here, but there is. In the left one, there's ember seeds. In the right one, there's scent seeds. So you can fill up your seeds, because that room will respawn those bushes and re respawn set items every time you go in that room. Now this one, it'll give you the other three seeds. Gale, Pegasus, Mystery. If you ever want to restock your seeds, and aren't nearby other seed trees and stuff, you can just go there. Good restocking place, I suppose. Well, what else is there to do in the world? Oh, there's that whole giant area up there I haven't been to. There's a couple of spots I have not been to. Eh, I shouldn't really worry about them, though. There's, like, nothing seriously... Well... Alright, I'll get a couple of things. Did I get this area in the spring? I don't remember if I got it or not. I'm gonna see it anyway. Yeah, I love that music. Oh, it needs to be spring, right? Yeah. Going down here. Gonna turn the season. Keep it spring. Gable, okay, jump up there. I'll also be able to show what's in that other area. And I'll show you why I don't like to go to that area. Alright. Pick this up. Throw it, guy! Get stabbed by guy. Dislike guy. Kill guy in one hit. I probably showed this area already. Oh, I probably showed it, but didn't have the gloves to do this. Hooray, another gosh of seed. Don't really need. I mean, I've got, like, tons. If I need more by now, something's wrong with the game's, uh, system. Because it makes me have to have, like, 20 C's in order to get a piece of heart. And on this screen, this sign will warn you. Danger! Like likes! Ah! Like likes! It's not like the Lost Woods, but it's still pretty bad. And what's in this screen? Because I haven't been there. Oh, I remember what's here. I, re I think I showed this off once, but I don't know why. It just didn't register. Gosh, I see! Anything else nearby? Up to left one. Might as well. It's a fairy fountain! Hooray! Get launched up here. And now we're in the other zone of the world where you can't change the season. Oh, I know what I can finish it off. I can finish this video off with a bang! Yes! Some of you know what I'm talking about. This is an incredibly evil thing to do, but... Some people called me bad things because I didn't do this. Remember King Moblin? Yeah. Turns out he can throw a bomb onto his pile of bombs. You have to leave the building somewhat fast, otherwise you get instant death. Alright. Looks like he ran off. Where'd he run off to? I don't know. Let's try and follow him. Maybe he went up here. Nope, not in here. I'll plant a seed here anyway. Did he go in that cave? Or is he just gone forever? Yep, looks like he's gone forever. Well, heroes, I think that about wraps up this video. Next time on Let's Play Legend of Zelda The Oracle of Seasons, I'll uh, be entering passwords, I guess. Later!